like broke up i just in my head like when i'm alone i start thinking like fuck i can't be in a relationship what if he's doing everything right would you let yourself be tied down um no i wouldn't because there's just always just <laughs> no i just wouldn't I wouldn't. It would be so hard for me. Do you speak Spanish? Yes, I do. Um, I'm the opposite. I want to be married. Yeah, I want to be married too, but I don't want to like owe every day of my life to somebody. Like... I want to be able to know that, like, we're married and, like, just can, like, I don't know, like, live. Like, I don't know, maybe I'm, I heard it's a humiliation ritual. No, I'm going to clarify that at least. It's not. Don't ever say that again. Um, no, he loves God and that's it. Okay, it's not no, do not ever, don't even put that around me, that's scary. An open marriage, no, I just don't, I don't know. I just, I don't know, marriage is weird sometimes when you think about it. Because like you're stuck with someone who can possibly be a liar. Like what if you spend 25 years with somebody and the whole time they were lying? I don't know. never heard your voice before yeah it's probably deep i have a deep voice i have a deep voice how is she gonna say it has to be like didn't i just answer the question <laughs> that just doesn't make sense how are you gonna tell me i'm wrong Um, okay, I'm done talking about that, um, because I'm reading all the comments and it's like, it's kind of like giving me anxiety, it's too much, uh, I was having a breakdown about it, like two days, I'm, see now I'm opening up about it, and it's just, if marriage is hard, oh man, I missed that comment. Open up. Where did you get your sweater? I'm honestly not sure. Story time on the worst dates ever. Um, I've never been on dates with weird people like that. Actually, there was a worst date that I was on. You're right. So I went to Mexico. And I was on a date with this soccer player. And um, he was just weird. Like, he just would stand around with his hands in his pockets. And, like, he was just really ugly, too. That's another thing. It's because I can't. He was just, it was not it. <laughs> Wait, it says... Did he not talk? No, he would talk, but he was just weird. Like, I like outgoing guys. Like, one thing about me is you'll never see me date a shy guy. Like, it's not... Like, my my guys have to talk. They have to be verbal. They have to be loud. So every guy I've ever dated, they're all the same. Like, they're like... I have a type. If he's not loud, can't talk to him. If he doesn't talk a lot can't talk to him if he's not handsome cannot talk to him he has to have everything every checklist you like leos i love leos i love virgos i just yeah i can't do those quiet guys are you picky with men 
Yeah, they have to be so handsome. Like, a guy has to literally be so handsome. Actually, I dated an Aquarius. I, well, I talked to an Aquarius. And he was cool. He was nice. Are you an outgoing person? Yeah, I am. Mm. That's why they're not for you, cat. Quiet guys are it. I mean, at this point, they're for me. And I'm for other people, too. <laughs> like, I, we can't be loyal in these days. No, just kidding. I don't know. Maybe. For the right one. <laughs> uh, why do you not have friends? Look at me. I'm on live at one in the morning. Who wants to be friends with somebody like that? <laughs> like, that's annoying. You low-key just said it for everyone. I mean, who cares? I'm 23. Let's live our lives. We go out. Have fun. As long as you take care of yourself. Where the baby's asleep. So, Imani's not here, but Raddy's asleep. Um... I love your mindset. Yeah, because I've been through some stuff, guys. Imani's with her dad. Yeah, I made him get her. I said, you better get her, get her right now. <laughs> I was like, you better pick her up. 